In this video, we're going to look at the concept of how many degrees there are on the interior angles of a triangle. So I've got a little triangle drawn here for you in red. And if you'll do this sometime, cut it out, and then take and tear off each of the angles. And then put them on a line at a point. So put one out here and put two up here and then three right here. And what you're going to find is that they equal a straight angle or 180 degrees. It doesn't matter what the angles are of your triangle. So what we find out is that the sum of the angles in a triangle is going to be equal to 180 degrees. So if you have two angles, 40 and 25, and you want to find out how big the third one is, it would be 40 plus 25, and you want to take all that away from 180. So that's 65, 180 minus 65 is 115. So the third angle will be 115 degrees. So we can use that idea now if we take a problem that says we have one angle in a triangle that we don't know, called x. Second angle is two times the first, so that would be 2x. And the third one is 20 more than the first. Well, if the first is x, 20 more than that would be 20 plus x. He want to know how big each angle is. Well, what we'll do is we'll take the three angles, x plus the 2x plus the 20 plus x, and that will be equal to 180. So what do you have? You have 4x plus 20 equals 180. So you have 4x equals 160. So x equals 40. So one angle is 40. One angle is twice that. It's 80. And the other one is 20 more than the first. So if you 20 more than that, it would be 60. Add them up, and what do you get? It's 180. So that kind of gives you an idea about angles and a triangle. I hope that helps you out, and as always, have a very happy day.